My name is Kain Tendogenius and today I'm going to be starting a machine learning course. The name of this course is Machine Learning 101. This course is meant for absolute beginners who want to become machine learning experts. Actually, I started making this lesson because I made an online survey. I asked my subscribers what lessons or what courses they would like to have. There are four options. We have computer, computer programming, we have machine learning, and we have uh, data science, we have databases, and we have computer science topics, five items. And could you believe that 100% of the respondents went for machine learning? So that is why I think machine learning is a big thing, is the, most, is, the, is the key thing now everybody wants to get involved with. And if you also look at the trend in technology, you find out that machine learning is the direction to go. For instance, you have self-driving cars, you have game playing devices, you have you have uh, robotics, you have uh, translational engines that can communicate with humans, and many things are actually driven by machine learning. And one thing you need to know is that traditional programming, that you have uh, this programming language, C++, Python, and all the things are gradually fading away, and we are coming into intelligent programming. We are going to talk about this a little later. Now, this is lesson one or lecture one of machine learning 101. So if you are looking to learn machine learning when you don't have any knowledge of machine learning, then you are in the right place. I'm going to also mention something you need to bear in mind, the fact that machine learning is actually a bit challenging. So if you are looking for a place to watch a video and sit back in your sofa, watch a video and become a machine learning expert, it will not be here. I cannot give that to you. What one thing I can tell you to do is to buy a notebook and a pen because it's challenging, but we are going to take it one bit at a time. I assure you that if you follow the classes, then you, at the end of the day, will become a machine learning expert if you actually put the right effort. The reason is because machine learning involves a number of things. We have, we have mathematics, we have calculus, we have probability, we have decision theory, we have information theory, we have... Uh, prog uh, uh, programming, we have a whole lot of things involved in machine learning. So I've actually decided to break down all of this, taking it right from the first step all the way. So there is not a series of videos I've made up and keep. It's, it's just I'm going to take it one at a time. So this is the first lesson. And one thing I want to tell you is you need to be consistent. So every week or every two times a week, there will be a lesson. It's going to be easy. Gradually, we'll move from easy to challenging without your even knowing it. So I'm going to go to the system and I'm going to show you what we are actually going to be doing because this class is called procedure-based lessons. Machine learning 101 I'm taking is going to be procedure-based. So what it means is that for every lesson, like this is the first lesson, there is a procedure that outlines everything I'm saying, all the pieces of code we are going to use, all the pieces of code we are going to use, all those applications we are going to use, everything is also mentioned in the procedure. So if you miss out something, something in what I'm saying, you can actually go to the procedure page and you'll find everything. So I hope that you put the right effort and I hope that you will actually become a machine learning expert, even if you are not a, 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 a the best professional, but you can actually come up to speed with what machine learning is all about and can decide on what direction you want to go with machine learning. So let's go to the page. This page corresponds to this lecture. This is Machine Learning 101 Lecture 1. The page is also in the description box below this video. You'll see a link to this page. You can open it and you can find these details. So let's go and then I, uh, we see a little more. So this is Machine Learning 101 Introduction to Machine Learning course. And as mentioned, I said this would be the very first of a complete machine learning course. If you intend to learn machine learning, you are in the right place. Now, there are some prerequisites. For instance, you, are, you have a science background, or probably you are passionate about artificial intelligence, or maybe you are interested, you are an enthusiast and want to, want to do what it takes to learn machine learning, or you are a programmer, or you have finance, accounting, or economics background, because you can use machine learning to make predictions, financial modeling, and so on. Or you would like to apply machine learning in your field of study for an analysis. Or you are somebody that loves challenges or somebody that loves math, mathematics. If you belong in any of these categories, then you are in the right place. 
we can actually start moving on. Now, how this tutorial or lectures is arranged? One, there's a weekly lesson, either every twice a week, there will be a class. Accompanied with each lesson will be a video. There will be a practical section after each period, say two weeks, they will have, we'll have a practical section and we are going to use certain tools I'm going to mention after now. It will also be interact interactive, so it's expected that everyone follows carefully. If you miss something, uh, comment on that lesson so that you have support. Also, feel free to invite your friends to join this class. Feel free to invite your friends. Uh, share this around so that as much people as we have, the better we have in this large community of machine learning 101. And we can help uh, help ourselves to get up to speed and also to understand the concept. So feel free to share, subscribe, and also help me by liking this video uh, if it's informative for you. There will also be quiz and there will also be homework periodically to ensure that you are following. I'll be giving certain homework and certain quiz from time to time. Now, the key application we are going to be using for this class is Jupyter Notebook. Yeah, Jupyter Notebook is a key application we are going to be using. Now, what is Jupyter Notebook? Jupyter Notebook, Notebook comes with Python, a distribution of Python. So, what you need to do uh, with this lecture is to download Anaconda and install Anaconda in your system. Now I'm not I'm not going to tell you how to download and install applications, but I hope that before the next lesson you have Python that is Anaconda set up in your system. Of course, of course Anaconda comes with Python, Jupyter Notebook, Spider. I think these are the three things. Have it set up in your system. Also, optionally, you can install R Studio. It's for free. You can install the free version. We are actually going to be using it some sometimes to clarify certain things we do. If you're a .NET programmer and you have already been using Microsoft tools like Visual Studio, you know C Sharp, then we also need ML.NET. So in this, you can look in the description box below, you find out how to add MS.NET to a solution that you are building in Visual Studio. Optionally, we also need MATLAB. So if you have a fast system, a really good system, make sure you have all these things installed so that we are going to be mentioning them, you are not going to miss out on anything. All right, so this is where I'm going to stop and I'm going to, these are a few nuggets, some things I've written up. Uh, you can actually spend time reading them if you want. If not, we are going to actually cover all these things later on. Let me now show you the Jupyter Notebook I've uh, installed. So if you install Anaconda in your system, maybe I'll just uh, show you how to get Anaconda. So simply go to Python Anaconda downloads. So from here you can easily down, uh, download Anaconda. So if you go to Windows, come here, and you can download 64-bit graphical installer, and you can easily install it for Windows or for Mac. So this is for Mac. So for Windows, you simply click on this place for Mac here. If you are using Linux, you go here. Set it up before the next class so you don't miss out anything. And finally, I'd like to mention that um, do we have some lessons made. Okay, this I mentioned here, Introduction to Machine Learning, but we are actually going to cover this at a later time. So, welcome to Machine Learning 101. Thank you for viewing. Remember, subscribe so that you don't miss out a thing. So, click on subscribe button below this video to subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of the, th on any of the classes or any of the updates. I'd like to thank you for viewing and uh, I'd like to wish you the best uh, in your learning, machine learning.